minutes. Well, the experience showed then after a, a tremendous amount of speedy moves from both men. Let's see if he can keep it up as we start round five any second. Seconds away for round five. Two to go. Now can Bernie Wright in the darker trunks come back here? He's done so well to stay with him. And there'll be only one fall down. And he caught his own throat on the top rope there. This won't do him any good at all. Wasn't even thrown. He's being thrown now, posting after posting. And Nader trying to make this a 2-0 win. And he held beautifully on that one time, missed with the... Completely missed with the drop kick there. Nader sidestepped it neatly. Well, all these back weakness must be taking a toll and slowing up this young fellow from Warrington. Nayla took it well, waiting for it. The leg grab spun out beautifully by Wright. Look, you can lazily just miss that one. And this is a Nayla special if he gets those feet up and time out of the arms. Uh, he's in trouble from it. He's been caught by his own trick there. Oh, very neat. Five seconds of round five. The equalizing fall goes to Wonderboy Bernie Wright. And an excellent move it was, too, because Naylor going over to congratulate him there. Because that was a Naylor speciality on the way there, that rope trick off the top rope, and it could have ended in disaster for this boy. But he saw it coming, obviously knew it, and maybe he's uh, taken on Naylor before and knew the trick. One round to go, and any second the bell. Second away, sixth and final round. One fall each. This is the final round. Are we going to get a decider here? The experience of the blonde nailer or the tremendous speed and fighting back ability of this boy, Bernie Wright? Just so much reminds you of, of young Steve Wright, his brother, when he first started in the ring. Excellent, excellent wrestler. It's going to be a move. He went in too far, Naylor, but fortunately got out of trouble. He went in a bit far there. He's smiling now, but I'm really glad that he, he missed that one. Very dangerous move. Good leg trip, Naylor. Now he can slow things down a little from here. Again, the toe and ankle. Drop kick didn't work, he missed time with the folding. No, that didn't quite work either for me. Both both moves were unintentional there, but at least he's got a double arm out of it, man. Back to his old favorite, the finger interlock. Naylor had better watch it here. He might just get a surprise from this boy and end up the, the loser here, which he would not like at all with his experience. There's another backdrop. A few more weakness coming from Nader now, showing he's worried at the speed of his opponent. Naylor with a monkey climb this time, and this time Bernie Wright didn't land quite so well. Again, the, uh, 
He's taken a lot of O's today. And it's a trudge hold and slam, followed down reverse double knee hold. Danger, danger for right, and he's got it. Naylor. So two minutes, 45 seconds into the final round six. Naylor finally the winner by two falls to one, but a magnificent effort by Wright. In the sixth and final round, after an excellent sporting professional wrestling contest, the winner by two falls to one, the golden ace, John Naylor. <laughs>